Welcome back everybody. Thank you so much for clicking on today's video. Today we're gonna to be talking about Neo Stock. Before I start the video guys, please make sure to leave a like on the video below. Subscribe to the channel for more awesome content. Join the family guys. Let's go on our invest journey together. So today we're gonna to be talking about Neo. as you guys can see up 11.41% today. And the biggest question is, is Neo Stock a very good buy at $46.05? Where is the stock headed? So we've definitely seen over the last week, Neo Stock up 17.41%. And a lot of people have been wondering, you know, is now a very good time to pick up Neo stock? For me, I absolutely think now is an amazing time to pick up Neo stock at $46.05. I mean, right now, I mean, this stock is absolutely a bargain. This stock has so much upside potential basically in the next year, in the next couple of years, in the next 10 years, as Neo continues to expand into China, we've definitely seen that a lot more people are getting bullish on Neo once again. You know, I feel like a lot of people have lost their bullish sentiment on NEO stock, but for me, I've stayed bullish the whole time through. Whether even I know that NEO one time was basically trading at $66, dropped all the way to $34, and I bought the dip out of NEO stock because I knew that this company is going to be absolutely massive. And even analysts are now saying, you know, pick up the big EV giants, which are like NEO, Tesla, because these stocks are going to be growing for a very long time. If you guys don't know what NEO actually does, NEO is an EV company based out of China. They produce luxury EV cars, pretty similar to what Tesla does. Like I said, NEO just happens to be based out of China, but NEO does offer a competitive advantage in a lot of different ways than other bunch of EV companies. So NEO really focuses on its cost effective production and it also focuses on making their vehicles very cost effective for their consumers for the customers who actually own the actual car themselves they focus a lot on like the battery swap station making sure that you know people don't have to stop and buy chargers or charge your own car but you can just stop by a station battery swap station they swap out the battery in just three minutes alone and you can continue on your way you know, a lot of people have definitely been getting a lot more bullish on NEO. And the reason that is because the EV market is very explosive. You know, the EV market is going to be growing for a very long time. I don't want people to be discouraged by, you know, the little bit of a pullback we did get. If we take a look at the one month chart, yes, NEO stock is still down 19.13% of its value. But if we take a look at the three month chart, still up 8%, one year chart up over 1,200%, and the five year chart, it's still up 667%. So the stock is still doing absolutely amazing. And I do recommend recommend people actually buy the dip on the stock. I mean, NEO is going to be growing for a very long time. We know this, right? They're trying to focus a lot more on their self-autonomous driving technology, focusing on driving a whole new product line. So if you guys don't know, you know, now Neo's dropping a brand new sedan. They're going to be dropping another sedan, another SUV, a minivan. And a lot of people do argue that the biggest challenge for Neo stock right now is the battery or not, not the battery shortage, excuse me, the chip shortage, right? So the chip shortage has definitely played in a huge weighing factor on Neo as a company. But Neo is still doing a very good job. I mean, the company already has plans to start expanding and selling cars in Europe by the middle of this year. You know, soon enough, I believe there is rumors that Neo wants to expand to the United States. Their vehicles are pretty cheap compared to its competitors, and Neo currently ranks number one among its Chinese competitor, Xpeng and Li Auto. So Neo is very a very good bargain at this price, forty six dollars twenty two cents. I mean, it's it's absolutely insane that people do not see the long term value behind Neo. And yes, I get I get it. Like people want the overnight results. People want Neo stock to go up to its all time highs basically as soon as possible. But that. That is not the way that people should be tackling investing, right? The EV market takes time to grow. You know, people want to see their sales. People want to see how many vehicles they're actually selling. But as the EV market continues to expand, especially in China, you know, where EV car sales have bloomed over sevenfold from in just one year alone, you know, a lot of analysts are now seeing that, okay, there's still a lot of growth to be covered for NIO as a company. And as Tesla as well and all the Chinese EV companies. You know, a lot of people, you know, they rotated out of EV and tech because they wanted to start kind of investing more in high value stocks. But the bullish sentiment for me has really ne never really changed on Neo stock. I think Neo stock is a great value. I think Neo brings a lot to the table as an EV company. It's very well established. Their sales are consistently increasing. You know, it has a lot of big time analysts behind its name. Bank of America, JB Morgan, Goldman Sachs, Deutsche Bank, all these big time investors have pretty high price targets for Neo. A lot of people betting Neo is going to hit 70, 75, $100. So for me, I do think that Neo stock is still going to hit $100 by the end of the year. I'm almost convinced that this stock is going to not stay at these levels for such a long time. This is why I, I'm telling everybody, you know, you guys should buy the dip. Obviously, everything I say in my videos is not financial advice. It's just my personal opinion. But seeing what Neo actually brings to the table, using a lot of innovative technology to make sure that their cars differentiate themselves from its competitors, you know, using the whole battery swap station idea, trying to perfect the self-autonomous driving technology, selling more cars every single month, bullish, 
you know, sentiment has not really changed on NEO. A lot more analysts are getting a lot more bullish on NEO, if anything, because people know that the EV market is going to be growing. The EV market is very explosive. This is why I think NEO stock is going to the absolute moon. I think NEO stock is a absolute great bargain at these prices. Yes, a lot of people may argue, you know, Right now is not a good time to buy NEO because people think that a bubble is going to pop or the EV market in itself is overvalued. But we must remember always that, you know, if you truly believe in the company, it does not matter how low the stock actually goes. It only matters about the long term investment, what the company is going to bring in the long term. And I can almost say with definite fact that NEO stock is going to be growing for a very long time. And it's a value price. The stock right now is still pretty cheap for what the company actually offers. Yes, will it ever revisit those all time highs if we go back to the three month chart? You know, Neo stock was trading around $62, and a lot of people who bought out those highs have been holding for a very long time. Patience is always key when it comes to investing. We, everyone knows that Neo is going to offer a lot as an EV company, and even we even got a new bullish analyst today saying that, you know, now is the very good time to pick up Neo stock because people are getting a lot more bullish. You know, analysts are getting a lot more bullish. It has the power of retail investors behind its side. A lot of retail investors support Neo stock. You know, it's not like XPeng or Lee Auto where they're not as publicly known or they're not as publicly attention advised. I guess you could say they don't get as much attention as Neo does. Like retail investors love Neo. Big time investors love Neo. Ark Invest loves Neo. A lot of big time investors love Neo stock because they know they see the long term value. And these big time analysts, you know, they're trained to see the long term value of stocks like Neo, you know, where the company could actually be headed in the next five to 10 years. As technology continues to grow, as Neo continues to sell more vehicles, as they start perfecting the self autonomous driving technology, and the battery swap station in itself is a very innovative idea, you know, Neo sales are definitely going to start increasing. And we definitely saw, like I said, based on the statistics, the Chinese EV market still has a lot of room to grow which is definitely going to be benefit Neo, Xpeng, Li Auto, and Tesla all in the long term as well. Once Neo actually starts expanding to the United States, it's also going to benefit in that long term as well because Neo can now drive itself to more clientele. Neo is now expanding to Europe, which is a very good sign that Neo is trying to expand outside of its Chinese territory. So now is a very good time to pick up Neo stock. $46.43. I do think Neo stock is going to hit $100 by the end of the year. And I think right now is a very great value to buy Neo stock. With that being said, guys, that's all I really have to say about the video. Let me know down in the comments section below, guys, what you think of Neo stock. Do you guys think Neo stock is a great buy at $46.46? If you guys own Neo stock, how many shares do you guys own? And what's your average? I'm always very curious to know. With that being said, guys, thank you. Have a great day.